Are you ready for another Eastern Conference matchup? Well, <laughs> it's a rematch time. As right now, New York Rangers have a 2-0 lead series in New York. But now, they're about to be playing at Pittsburgh to play against the Penguins. They're at the PPG Paints Arena. As we all have heard that we passed there one time and we saw them. A lot of fans are coming to the game to see the Capitals and the Penguins at the same time. I always know that this was a fun uh, fun trip here at Pittsburgh, but at the end of the year of end of the day of hockey festival. Well, it's been a fun one so far, and now we've really enjoyed it too. With amazing game out there. So far, we are about to be seeing the next matchup, and we're about to be seeing Rangers as they are about to be playing here at Pittsburgh. Last time they are already at Madison Square Garden, which was a fun one. And now, I like to bring things back in. And coming back in along the sideline is OJ. Hey, thank you very much for joining me in. It's been a very great pleasure of yours. How does it feel now to be here? Well, uh, it's been all good so far. A lot of game matchups have turned out to be completion. As we already have uh, seen Stars and Avalanche as Stars have now made a win here in the third game. Then we have is the Eastern Conference of this showdown as the Capitals have won in the third game in overtime. It was impressive to see that game. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's interesting to see that it looks like they beat the upsetting teams and now they're on the board here too. Then we have is the Oilers beating over the Kings in a third game at Edmonton. This was the toughest matchup in this back-to-back -back switch. As it now turns to be Edmonton going back in the lead. It's a rivalry matchup in between USA and Canada. That is the only game that I've ever saw before. But I think this next rival is a secondary rival. New York and Pittsburgh. Ooh, I have no idea what to go for, but it looks like that if Sidney Crosby has another way to get right into the beauty backhand, I really would like to see how this all turned out. So this has to be a good one. This really has to be a good one if there's a chance for them to give it a shot. So I think there might be a solution there that we can keep an eyes on. So, well, yeah, there you have it there. We'll find out if they, if they made a change to make them square and simple. Let's head you down to Pittsburgh to start the game. This is about to be a fun matchup, and we are ready to see this Eastern Conference rival secondary in between those two teams, and we're about to be ready to stake things on. The arena is packed, and it's now time for the Rangers and Penguins to play here in this stadium. Penguins wins the faceoff, and we are underway here in Pittsburgh. Here's Double A, and as he happens to have to score his ability of his timing, might be going for his first one to take a look of his, of his game of how he does here so far. Well, it's best for me that uh, the Rangers have already play, played against the Penguins. They've already won three games and made a one loss here, playing for last year in 2021. So now this might be another change up there. If there's, there's going to be another way to get right by it, well, there might be another way to get right around it. This is a start here as the score is now even and it's still dead in the books. Rangers wins the tip off in the defensive zone. Lafreniere scoops up to Zibanejad. Zibanejad has the control of the puck. Gets whacked up by the defender. And Latang takes that one away. He moves over to Crosby. He carries it past the neutral zone. He goes inside, it's stopped by Shesterkin. Shesterkin only made him, they call him like a goat. Now he has it all carried out. Moves over to Fox, back to Lindgren. Fox backing in, in the shot, it's the nine. Good draw right to Lindgren. He moves in, Jory with the save me. Jory has all, all even up in making control. Now he needs no. That it's definitely very hard to make him make a good pass. Good draw! Shots denied! And he gets whacked down as Goodrew helps it out with the rebound. Moves it quickly over to Truba. 
Who's it back to Zabanajad? And it's bad pass. Hayden's got the puck though, right on the offensive end. Demolin with the with the takeover chance. Stop by the goaltender. New York's going along the offensive end now for the breakaway chance. Lindgren moves over to Truba. Back to Lindgren. He's in the shot. Saved me by Jari. Jari has it all around the board. They, they know how he can definitely play for. We can feel this heat as it comes down with a, with a tight battle range. New York wins the faceoff to resume the play. Miller up. Takes the shot and it goes with a glove save by Jari. Oh, bad connection here for Pittsburgh. But now Matheson will try to reset things up to start all over again. Pittsburgh in the neutral zone. Finds Kapanen. Hayden off with the, off with the release man. Now he moves over to Hunt. Hunt in the attack. 2-0-1, 3-0-1. Bad block shot and Jari comes out to save the puck to stop the run. And now they will get a chance to get some break here. Lot of timing and he helped the teammate as McKellogg will help him out with the faceoff win. Schneider and they will have to carry it out out of his zone for a regroup. Still lots of time as the score is not it. Not in time, it's still nothing. Moreno has gotten the control. Rodriguez has it up. And it's denied away by Shostokin. Moves it quickly over to Rooney. Schneider with the puck. In the offensive end. Reeves stopped by the goaltender. It's Jory with the save. No, this will not carry out with the goal. That will, that will be a save. Sure thing that Reeves has, um, has more intense, an intense matchup as he has. Sometimes it gets things that are just a, a tough rebounding in with the other defenseman. Now they all know that they have him out here through. They can try to do it what they can. Wow, so Stucky makes a glove save and the puck clears out. Rangers are picking up steam. Here on one. And a bad release here as Reeves couldn't help him make a two on one attack. Still more time as we are, as there's still nothing on the board. Didn't make that midway point yet. Pittsburgh wins off for the defensive zone. McGinn still getting on cross around the board. Now he moves over to Mason. Matheson inside. Marino. Rechecked it away. Saved me by Shesterkin. Hedl with the puck. Now he finds Hunt. Hunt shot was off. Hunter with the steal. Holds the puck inside a neutral. Lindgren off to Fox. Shoots. Off the goaltender it goes. Hedl tries to rebound it. They really got a lot of each, uh, rebounders. They know what they have. But sometimes and even it takes them to make the, the same mate sake. That's all he had. That's what they, becomes a little bit of whack off. Hunt moves over to Strong. Inside now. It increases it. Backhand shot. Off target it goes. Lindgren off to Fox. He shoots well. Saved me by Jari. Two times saved. Marino. This is off to Carter. Now in the offensive end. Russ gets a little heavy traffic with the, with the bust. A little busted out the moving here. Might need to show something off. Strong. No man advantage here as he dishes back on the board. Truba right to Miller. Truba back again. Panarin shot. Goudreau saved me by Jari. Jari knows his steals. Now he has it up in cover transition to make it between tricks. 
Penguins reaching into the air, offensive end, passing the neutral zone. Beauty back in, not a good chance. Lafaniere has it all covered up. Scoops up the board by Strong. Gets banged up by Latang. Strong trying to help him out to make him pay. Now DeMullen off to Crosby. DeMullen up! He stopped the goals, and this was a little traffic bumper car hockey. It is true, because the bumper car hockey really has found to pay the price of it. What a save by Jari! And he will stop the play here, just a one left. This is a heavy traffic here, and it's a great day for hockey to enjoy here in Pittsburgh. They always do. We really love enjoying hockey. Everybody. It's for everyone, not for just uh, just only old people. And with another bad release save made by the goaltender. Hayden's got a puck right along the defensive end. Now it goes to Makin. Back to Dumoulin. Now it moves over to Kapanen. Up to Latang. Inside! Save me by goaltender of Sisterkin. Zibanejad recovers the puck. Moves over to Kreider. Latang stakes it over. Moves it quickly over to Hayden. Try to wrist one. And it's off the pad it goes. Coming inside. Save me by Kostokin. This is very tough in between the matchups of the zones. Those goalies are definitely good. Poke checked away by Kreider. Now Snyder. Back to Kreider. Inside Miller. Releases. And it's off the uh, pad. This is the two on one. Lindgren has it covered. New York's going back in the offensive end for the end of our attacking zone. Kreider, backhand release, off target. Reeves, Fox, back to Lindgren. Takes a shot. Rebound and save me by Jari. Jari really sure does come along. And this one comes to a, comes to a halt ramble here in between the two guys. In between offense and defense players. The tag. Save is off the pad it goes. Wow, being up here. He goes right back to McKinn. Inside. Oh, he just couldn't save it. And another save by Shesterkin. Shesterkin has it all even covered out there. Many times for Shesterkin without Hendrik Lundqvist. He now knows his skills. He has a lot of intense speed. Matchups in carry. Fox takes a big hit. Rooney with the save. Lindgren back to Goffier. Now the Rangers are moving the puck back and forth. Fox inside. Jerry comes up another save. McKinn's got it along the offensive boards. And now the attack. Hope checked again. Fox delivers it on the other end. Heedle with the shot. Suck made by Jari. Jari will hold on to the puck. And now it will be 222 left in the first period. Almost finished for first period. Still no goals yet for the between the two teams. Pittsburgh has resumes the, resumes the play. Russ, all right, on Miller. Puck checks again. And it's taken away by Gisnell. Gisnell, he's saving it again for Sesterkin. He knows it's better. Quick reaction to it. Beauty backhand still doesn't work out. And it's already in front. Hedo delivers off to Hyatt. Right to Goodrow with the wrist. Just couldn't save it. And it goes off the back. Crosby any of her control. Miller with the puck. Last minute to play in the first period. Still no goals yet. Good row up. Backhand. No good. Rust. Back to Crosby. Pittsburgh's got their own control. Zetzel. Gives off wide target. Strong with the recover. Strong really knows his way. Strong couldn't find anybody. 
Hand. Looks for his foot, for his open player, Crosby up, two seconds, Strom will deliver it off with the end of the first period. It is no goals yet, as it's still zero. Tough matchups, we'll be right back. The Penguins and Rangers are back on ice, and we're about to start the second period. And you're on your way now. Get ready to go for the faceoff. Here we go. Rust. Oh, he just didn't save it back in time. Looks like the best that Sisterkin really has gotten something out in control. He knows his way through. Lafaniere regroups. Goes back to Lindgren. Moves over to Fox. Fox releases. That's denied by a shot by a good block. Lindgren back to Fox. Lafreniere back to Lindgren. He's inside. He scores! Lindgren releases his first goal in the third game. Look at that. That's a tape to tape action gear with Adam Fox to Lindgren. And it goes back in, and now what happens here? Here was a slap shot he made. New York has pulled up a first game lead off here in the second period, and it's now a 1-0 lead in the, in the third game. Strom will stop here when it goes offside. Still lots of time left. No goals yet for the Pittsburgh Penguins yet. Rangers keep it in control. It went out of reach. Icing is the call on New York. There's so many hits here for this game that turned out to be just a bunch of them in between game one and three, but there might be game four that could be coming in there. Yeah, I would definitely agree because what happens is those players give it a lot of a hard time at this average and now they need to find something else to go right for the attack. Wow! A score releases on Ryan Strom and it's now 2-0 lead! Make it quick, make it count. Ryan Strom delivers it up here with a wraparound shot hitting the goalpost and now they have our average. It's 2-0 as Rangers are keeping the pressure still and for Penguins, hasn't released a goal yet. This keeps up happening. Now they need to know where they're going to come at. Now Timmy Panarin has his first assist here in the game. And now Crosby coming back in. Stick lifted off on uh, Crosby going back to resume the play. Oh, what a stick made. Save me from the other end. Good row. Russell's down. He puts it around to Panarin. And Aaron is just off to Gauthier. Miller finds Struba. Almost went stick loose. Back to Miller. Almost loose. And Aaron couldn't find anybody. Gauthier back in. Stopped by Jari. Miller gets Russell down. It's Crosby. Time for another one. This attacker is like going right from big and square. Now Crosby wants revenge. He wants to stop someone from going from puck to puck. Wow, Russ didn't really save it all. And Truba comes in to save it. Crosby has it still covered. Goes hard on board. Crosby! Backhander saved me by Sisterkin. Rangers on to the attack. Keto moves the board around Goffier. Truba looking over is Miller. With a shot, it's denied with a block. Goffier inside, saved me by Jari. They will hold the puck now as we're under 15 minutes left. We're not at the midway point yet. And you now know that Sisterkin and Harry has a little average in between the range offs. There was a chance for Sisterkin to give another big save. How does it really feel once this comes up on the board, oh, OJ? They know his secret. Now for Jory, in, because of what he has really done so far, 
He really gives it off to one of the players, but they have it inside the range, and now they have it outwards. But for, but for Sturkin, he now has it all. Offside is the call on Pittsburgh. They will resume, they will stop the play to restart their transition. Sabanajad has a magnetic tool ability using the blades to you put the puck in control and have it in front with the stick. They now knows his secret. Now there's a chance here for Sabanajad if they want to get some magnetic tapes to tapes. Back to Snyder. Schneider! Sigal good save by Jari. And he will hold the puck here to clear out the zone. Just a minute to go here, as we already have gotten two nothing for the Rangers to pick up. Rangers wins again. Off the Jari. Zibanejad couldn't save it, but puck again. Kabanen's got all along the offensive board in now for the attack. Wow, he just ran heavy battle. The clash, clash, attack, attack. There is much more of it that can be happening here. Malkin's got it on the long defensive end. Kapanen dishes off the long pass to Hannon. And inside, it's deflected away. Kreider with a two-on-one attack. To Barachad! Hazel goes off the wide off range, and a save comes up by Jari. Jari really has shown up here before. Quick reaction, got it in time. Oh, here comes Lafaniere. His save made by Jari. Marino still has it again. They haven't scored yet for the second period. McKinn, Rodriguez, save made by Shusterkin. New York's got the pressure in the offensive end. Lindgren back to Panarin. Make it snap, and it just went out to out of mid air. Fox inside. Jory saves with a glove save. Jory has saved it. He knows his pressure. He knows his way to get right through it, and they need something else to go with them. Rangers resumes the play. Lindgren, glove saved by Jari. What a play and a catch made. We're midway between the period as this now it turns to be a New York Rangers 2-0. And for Pittsburgh needs to find something else to try to uh, save them to be on the board. This board's intentional speed of the working. They need something else to go right from it instead. Lindgren back past the Fox. Almost went broken up. Oh, the shot blocked. Hedo wants to stop one. And now it's Rodriguez. Penguins in control. Goffier is kind of a puck across. Gets squeezed in. And two on one. Backhand. He scores. He went in for the toll. It looks like that Philip was going to get there in time, but I think that Philip was going to have to try to put it back in there. They didn't really call that one. No save me. Well, it's very tough to be uh, in, in between the attackers. New York ranges up 3 nothing in a series of, of this one if they can keep it going again. Schetzel, Fox, and here comes the penalty. This one's going to keep it in the fighting. And the fight is over. We settles down here with him on Demolin, and this was like a hurtful bad timing. Yeah, this all turns out because of reason Dumoulin would really be in the pressure now. Now they, so these are the two that can definitely be a penalty, and that could be bad for the team fans to be stunned. We're under a minute right now for this uh, midway period. It's 3 nothing, New York Rangers. And this one goes in, blocked up by Goodrow. 
Panarin, he goes down. Rooney stells it across the screen. Realistic, it's denied. Crosby on Fox. Wilts it in there. Back to Panarin. Panarin suiting in to the offensive end. Now moves over to Fox. McKay to Rooney. He gets traffic and heavy with a bang bang moment. This really does stand out because the only between the tricks, they know that one. Wow, the big heavy attacker that Crosby couldn't try to make another backhand shot. And they have to stop the play. Pittsburgh wins again. Shesterkin another save. Still more, more time here, as there's still enough to get advantage here if there's a chance for the Rangers to get them on the board. Win again, shot blocked. Marino still receiving him to society, trying to work his way around. Lindgren takes it over. The Rangers are picking up steam. On the board, Fox. Dunn delivers it, and it goes up with a bad release. McKinnon inside. Reaches off to Lindgren. Now he's in back in the offensive end. Kreider outside. Fox over to Lindgren. Lindgren up. Carries a glove save by Jari, and that's another huge save victory. It's not a victory anyway. It's still another save me. But there is another chance here. Well, I wouldn't even complain if there was a chance to change up. Rangers keeps it playing into position for the second period. Miller back to golf here. Carter in control. Hedo takes it over. This is going to be a back-to-back -back close out range. And no passes there tipped away for golf here. McKay on around the board, passing the neutral zone. Inside, rechecked it out. Reaches up to Truba. Truba right over to Carter. Moves it quickly over to Miller. Truba in the shot, and his play is out and over the netting. There's much more changeup that they're having a lot of the issue with. After playing with the Bruins for the Rangers, they now have the advantage here to win in overtime. How does it really come out with a, with a stinction that they have played? They've really done that so far because they've just really gotten a lot of, uh, a lot of heat, heating control and mobility. Now they need to know it's getting a little bit tougher than they have. Miller, Truba. Back to Miller. Reaching in and it's Hannon taking it over. Cobbin inside. Hannon strong back in the other way. Truba has it covered. And this carries offside. Only 4 12 remaining. The Rangers are still in the lead right now. No change off switch here for between two teams. They know their way, and they know they can definitely try to do it harder. And then they had Lafaniere up on around the board. Guy gets big hit. Sabatajad trying to work with the poke check. Malkin right in the Zuchel zone. Inside, Sylvester Skirkin with the save. Lafaniere right to Kreider. Kreider releases, the backhand's out, and it goes out of play. Great save here by Jari. Looks like Kreider was looking for a chance to make the hat trick shot, but it was carried off wide. Adam Fox only take the tape measures here, and now this is all he has done to make his way through. Reaching over is Lindgren. He shoots, saved by Jari. Now he just gives out here, just out of the reach. Goes to Latane. Now he scoots in the offensive zone. Ryder goes. And it's denied. Now Dolan. 
Back to McGinn. Right to McCarter. Carter inside. DeMullen. Latang. Inside. Save me by Sisterkin. This really does stand out because that was very tough. Icing is the call and they will stop the play handling here with another with another take tank off. This only turns out that every player in this challenge is really, really taking forces on the drive. Now they need to know they gotta find another way to get it. Wow, great save by the goaltender went off. New York back in the offensive zone. Demolin has it covered out. Lafreniere trying to stop one. Rust backing in the offensive zone for Pittsburgh. Last minute left to play in the second period. Hito recovers. Moves off to Goffier. Goffier finds Truba. He shoots off the target it goes. Fox on Crosby trying to like watch out for his run. The attacker's not going to look very good here because all that happens here, they now know his way in. Wow, he gets beaten up here. Another aggressive inside his zones. Truba outside! Off the pole! And that will do the second period. One goal advantage, two goals, three goals, I meant. This all happens here in the second period. Nothing for first period, but now it's for second period. 3-0 is the score. We'll be right back. Third quarter is coming up after the break. Me and OJ back in the uh, commentating and wrap to wrap things up here for the third game. Puck just dropped and we all set to go for the last period left. Wow, just Sturkin went for a save me to start the third cool period. And now it's Kreider in the attack. Looking for a backhand. Jari saves it. And he stops the puck as they will now hold up a moment to try to, to try to go with another plan out. Each between shots and games, this really does stand out with another quick release spin. They need to know what they can definitely need to go for, but this is all it took. The takeoff inbound inbounding position, this really has gotten a lot of change-ups here that may be pushing pressure. And still, there might be another way to get right by it. Kreider inside. Lafreniere! Jari with stops with the glove save. That's a quick reaction. That's a good on work crew because now he shows up. Fox will deliver it from behind the net. Ingram K trying to hold on to it. Fox still needs to find his way for his advantage. Zibanejad. In with a tack out. Hannon looking forward inside the paint. Now goes right to Panarin. In the wing. Get off to Goodrow. To Bandit scores. It's a 4 0 lead. And the Rangers are pushing pressure still. Zabanajad has gotten a lot of ability. Now he's getting there, there close. So finally, Sabanajad gets his first goal in the third game of the season after with nothing to resist. Now this all turns to be another quick outrun. Panarin, still working his way around. He gets knocked down. Strom fires wide. Back to Truba. In for time. Goes off out of stick reach. Miller over to Truba. He shoots, and it goes off target. Carter with the puck. Penguins needs to find their way through. And Panarin stops in by. McKenz recovers. Carter up. He scores! They now have it up. And it's 4-1 Penguins. This all turns to be here. The favorite of all it turns to be Segan. He lost the puck. Couldn't save it, and now he's all ready to pretend like he was ready for the third period. Because the first and second periods were shut down. Now, they have it in control to bring it back in to break out for the third period. Puck around the board to Gauthier. Moves it quickly to Truba. Make him with an on-man rush. And he just couldn't save it back. 
This really does stand out as the timing. This really does give him a worth free credit. He all right to Hunt. Hunt shoots. Delivers across. Save me by a jarring. Now they will slow things down a bit with 15.03 left. This healing fresh of this one comes in by. New York's got their own fourth goal of each season. And now this is now, now this is going to be another change up here to look for a heavy run. Heavy run and traffic can definitely be only one described, but they wanted to put the Rangers town to go for a great place to be playing here for hockey. Hunt! Bad pass he carries as Mate Matheson with this takeaway. Russ in control pursuit. This will reject and regroup it to be on for Pittsburgh. Moves it quickly over to Russ. And it is, is inside the offensive zone. Crosby! Shot goes wide. Rangers looking to steam. Cross inside! And it's another pass saved made by Zisterkin. This Zisterkin really does it all then. He's really not. He really not want to miss that one out. Wow, gets flipped away. Lafreniere. Holding the puck. Marano still gets it covered. Holding the puck with deflecting and it pulls up around the boards. The advantage out over to Jones, right to Kreider. Kreider, that broken up. Now they will have to reforce the group to try again from the top. Moves over to Kreider with the shot. Up it goes. Wow, what a save by Jory. It almost tipped inside over the backhead. They almost did. It was close enough to be calling in here. Now they have it all through. Long deep pass to Kreider. Rolls up to Lafreniere. Numbers inside. Stop by Jare. Oh, what a big save. The stall games would be extending up here as they still need some advantage out there. They're looking for someone to go for the face-off attack. Pittsburgh has Simon. Right back in the neutral zone. Off to the tie. Off again. Jones recovers. Couldn't find the one man opener. Boil up. He scores! That's two to four. Trailing it in. Brian Boyle, what a play here, and now he has his first goal in third game. He is all quiet out there for his first and second period, but at this time, he's now in the third period. He is really dominating the up for this moment. Pittsburgh looking for a chance, Simon all alone. He just shows up in time. Wow. Wow, he's just knocking things over out there, almost about to be tipping the goal. Sisterkin still in position right down there. He's skating out strong to be a GOAT. Igor looking for a chance to make another uh, save out there. If the chance is up there made, there might be someone out there. Two on one. Panarin can't find him. Miller pushes up to Truba. Back over is Miller. Shoots inside. Heavy traffic comes in by. Penguins back in the offensive zone. The tang. Demolin in pursuit. Finds inside. It's a Sturkin with the save. Panarin with the puck controller right around the board. Takes a shot. That goes off the side of a gully pad. That's a great help here on offense. Now this is going to be helping on defense to find a way to make them around and pay for. They know what they have to do. They really got to go for another chance. They got to find another way to get right around it. McKay, bad releases for Carter. Bochek delivers out with the denying. McKay still in recover. Reeves cast taking the puck away. Moves to McKay. McKay's inside. Backhand shot, no good, the denies by Jari. 
Jari that's still saving it. He's walking it up a moment. Only 7.30 to play. Runner Goose. Club save by Shesterkin. Shesterkin really does that time. Now he's really going for it, our one. McKenna up. Shot denied from the goaltender. It goes wide. Runner Goose couldn't save it. Fox inside. Back into the pass. Roderick is going alone. And he couldn't save it. It's just Sturkin saving it on a bound off. Puck clears out. And it's Lafreniere beating the icing with the whistle was called. Yeah, it looks like I don't see the man going with the offensive on the attack. It looks like it really wanted to like stop here. They don't want the man to go right from back and back. Penguins in back in neutral to back to offense. Back with a block with a pass. Crosby saved by Shesterkin. Moves over to Heedle. Heedle went down for it. Now it's Jones. Schneider recovers the puck. Moves it quickly over to Cryer. One timer. Chuck blocked. And it inside. Goes in the wing. It's blocked up by Heedle. Heedle made a great save out there. Now he knows his way. As icing is now being refed out on New York with only 431 remaining. Only face-off wins is even up, but the next one can be tricky. Pittsburgh wins their lead and now they have it up by one. Gauthier still working their way around. Puck clears. And Jari will help him make the save. Malkin back in a neutral zone. Back to the offense. And the board again. Almost been rejected up. It's Lindgren holding on. Back in the Good roll. And he just put it in. They're going to count that one in there, and Goodrew gets his first, and goal turns up 5-2. I don't know what to say, because if Mark Goodrow, watch what happens. It looks like they were supposed to challenge that call. They need to challenge it, because what happened here, they have to make the save. I don't know what to say, but it looks like they were going to review it, but they did not, because right now, the puck was loose. Pittsburgh has their own, own end now. And it gets ground in traffic. Booming up. Kapanen. Inside. Saved me by Susterkin. Oh boy. And the, uh, and, the, and the Penguins fans are in complete shock right now. Now this really does stand out. This really is going to be a very workout through. All because of the uh, higher rankings of players. They know their way through. Backhand pass to Lindgren. News over to Panarin. Panarin has his puck back in transition. Good row. Back to Strom. Backhand shot. Denied by the player. Strom in now. Truba right over to Miller. He shoots. He scores. First goal of the season. Postseason. Wraps up 6-2. Well, Keandre Miller has finally reached himself with this first goal of the night. What a wacky play. And for this one, I'm going to definitely say that Keandre Miller is on the board. He's ready for it. Now he got it all through. And New York extends their lead series. It's a wild, wild game for New York to be showing off their ability. Better than the Islanders and the Devils. Well, the Devils really wasn't going to be my favorite to be here. But I would have been here to be known. It might be tough. And a save off the path by Shesterkin. And we come down to the last minute period for the third. Sebastian works up to Miller. Goes out of nowhere. And it's Truga taking over it. Lapinier scoots up to the wall board. And put a bad release. The odd man rush coming in. 
And he stops it. Truba really stuns there now. But he shows up in time. He knows that one. Getting better at that play. Now he really does go up with a huge great takeoff. And this one puck clears out. Kreider holds on to the puck and beats the icing. Goffier backhand saved by Jari. And the puck is down being froze out. The timing is running out. All because if you know that the, that the players really have hydrated it up, now they need to find something else to go right through it instead. Mapleson in the neutral zone to Carter. Six seconds to go, and Heedle will close things off. The Rangers shut them down on the Penguins with a 3-0 victory in the series. And this was like a defensive of this game. Shostorkin is the GOAT. They all champ for Igor, not even for the away game, but a home game. They have it all carried up. And that should do it here of secondary rival was not that bad. We'll see them back in game four after game three matchups are complete, but now we only have one more left. It will be the Wilds and Predators playing at Bridgestone Arena. We'll stick you around here for the second game, but for me and OJ, this has been a presentation of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Well, for fun, and I, I really enjoyed it too. Also, with, with the Hurricanes and Bruins, too. And now we are about to present the three star players of the game. So, it's time to stick you up, OJ. You take it, finish from here. Thank you very much. Number three, we have is Barclay Goodrow. He finally has his goal, and he now finally has his assist. The back end of releases always turned out to be one timing, and now he had all through. Second star goes to Ryan Lindgren. One goal, one assist, and took out five hits. Bang, bang, with the attack. Now we know their way. They got it all through. And for number one, the whole player comes down to this. It's Igor Shosturkin, 37 saves, .949. He's like the goat, the king of the Rangers. And yeah, that should definitely uh, say that Shosturkin Really knows this way, but there is no Alexander Georgiev, and we we, we could have uh, added him from the line, but uh, we'll have to like see him for Game Four if there's a chance. Well, there might be another way to get around it. So that ends it up. Second game will be underway next, but thank you all for watching. Until next time, peace out, everyone. For a while, as the Stanley Cup playoffs of NHL 22 dial. This last matchup is underway next. See you in just a bit.